是千鸟，今天要为大家带来的是《地平线：期待黎明》。这边是哪里啊？哦，我跑到宫殿里来了！快快快快快 ！Look at you, Avad. The wriggling runt of a maniac king. You robbed me of my right to kill your father, so I'll have to settle for you. I'm going to enjoy watching the Karja burn, even more because you'll be watching with me. Say goodbye to Meridian Avad. Breathe in the stench and choke on the ashes. <laughs> it didn't. I I didn't hear anything. There's a bit of smoke rising from the mesa's edge. No. It should be a firestorm, not some belt from a charcoal burner. Hey, I just already stole that ear piece. Or is it I just have it? I don't know. I just have it. 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 What's this? Oh. You must be the Nora who bushwhacked my camp. And disabled your bomb. Did you now? Well, bomb or no bomb, I'm gonna splatter that throne with blood. First yours, then Avad's. Okay. I've led an army. Kestrels and ravagers, a savage is nothing. Hey, oh! Finish this. I've got a sun god to kill. Sauce me. Why does a bard always have his lady? Oh! Oh, me, oh, me. He, that is, will have blood. 结束了。Any good Osiran Tinker will tell you. Always have a third plan. 什么？引引机器。Majestic, murderous glint hawks. I hope you like fighting these things, because there's more in the way. Never do the work if you can get a machine to do it for you. 召唤三只闪光，就想要击倒我，可是超级猎人呢、欸，想太美了吧？还有一只嘞。好像不止三只哦。啊！你看，红色的闪光。
never do the work if you can get a machine to do it for you. I hope you like fighting these things, because there's more in the way. Yeah, as much as I wish I was here too. I don't mind doing it for her. Go ahead. I'm not afraid. Except that knowing you, Aaron, you'll screw it up. I know what you are afraid of. Going back to Mainspring in chains. Every clan in the claim wants you dead. And they know how to make it hurt. They'll even bid for the privilege. It's just like you to get someone else to do your killing. Shut up. You're at the Sun King's mercy now. Could you spare a moment to speak with the fire things? Come to gloat, Nora. Well, as you can see, I get it. You want to rub it in? Well, it's not working. Ha ha! It's funny to pester the tinker in the cage. What a laugh! <laughs> you think that bit of scrap on your brow makes you smart? I'll bet you couldn't have taken apart my bomb. Think I'm done? <laughs> think again. I've gotten out of worse scrapes. While the lunkheads in Mainspring dither over how to kill me, I'll take <laughs> myself out. Just you wait. When I get out of here, I'm going to plant a thunderjaw over an old bed. Gotta admit, it burns me that a savage tracked me down. 
Most nor I get confused by anything more than two sticks and a string. Don't you have something better to do? <laughs> you think that spear of yours is so fancy, but I could craft it blindfolded during a quick nap. Aloy, I was just thinking about Ursa. She would have killed Durval on the spot. I know it. That's why she went out to meet him in the first place, to put him down. But she also told me to grow up. I gotta admit it burned a little when she said that, but I'm trying to take it to heart. And I guess growing up means putting what you should do in front of what you want to do, right? <laughs> you're asking me? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're older. Well, it's how you yeah, but I don't act like it, do I? You did with Durval. Now, don't give me too much credit. Part of me still wants to wait for a quiet moment and wring his neck. Yeah, but you won't. Because you're a good captain. Come on, stop. You're gonna make me tear up. So I'm going to go back to the house. I'm not going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. So, after all this, what's next for Errand Vanguardsman? Uh, heading back to the claim for a while. I'll get in touch with my clan and we'll lay Ursa to rest properly. Like how she would have wanted. And by that I mean less chit chat, more drinking. What do you think the Osirim will do to Durval? First off, they'll argue about it for a long time. But whatever they come up with, it won't be quick. I can live with that. In fact, I might just drop by his cell under the sun ring to remind him what's coming. <laughs> well... I know. You gotta go. Killers to track, machines to master. All before breakfast. You know what? When we met, I thought I was a big shot talking to a pretty girl hidden away in the middle of nowhere. And now I see that I was just lucky to get a minute of your time. Try not to forget about me, while you're out there changing the world. I'll always have a minute for you. Maybe even two. Two? Huh. She likes me. Aloy. To say you have my gratitude feels woefully insufficient. You saved my life. You saved Meridian. And because of you, there will be justice for Ursa's murder. We can mourn her knowing the truth, without painful uncertainty. It's hard to imagine where we'd be without you. And I don't want to try. I hope you will consider staying in Meridian. <laughs> Were you and Ursa, you know? I suppose it's obvious how I feel, how I felt about her. She didn't just give me advice. She gave me strength. But we couldn't be together. Relations between the Karja and Osiram and Meridian were unsteady as it was. Osiram warrior would have led to open revolt in the city. And probably war with the clans. Did anyone know? Only one. Derval. He wanted Ursa, but she rejected him. And so jealousy became yet another of his hateful motivations. What exactly will happen to Derval? For now, 
He'll languish in one of the old cells under the Sunring here in Meridian. As for what happens after we negotiate his expedition to Mainspring, I don't want to think about it. My father was very creative when it came to inflicting suffering. But some Oseram devices surpass even his imaginings. Durval is a brilliant man. I wonder what he would have accomplished if it weren't for my father's cruelty. Why do you want me to stay in Meridian? Well, I would think that would be obvious. Not to me. Huh. Well, to start with, you kept the city from going up in flames. You were strong, shrewd, and, and capable. I could use someone like you at my side. Dunda. 他这样的意思是我还有事情要做 Thank you for the offer, but I don't think either you or I are ready for that. At least, not yet. I've got a long way to go before I find what I'm looking for, and it's going to take me far from Meridian. Well, of course. I, I didn't mean to presume. You are your own woman. Just as Ursa was. But please, remember that you're always welcome here. I hope that today is just a sunrise for us. Not a goodbye. It's Hi, time Dan. for me to go. Of course. I hope you find what you're after, Aloy. And if need be, I will come to your aid. As sure as the sun's rising. Wasn't 喜欢的话可以帮忙按个喜欢